Hi there. I am representing WebTrackOfficial.com. We provide all sorts of digital marketing solutions like web designing, social media integration, search engine optimization, graphic designing and logo designing. So if you want any services from us, contact us at support at WebTrackOfficial.com. In this video I am going to show you how you can fix your sitemap issue in Google Search Console. But if you have no idea what sitemap is, or where it's used or how to use it, watch my complete SEO tutorial here. Now, whenever you try to submit your website sitemap, it says couldn't fetch. Now here you can see, I have submitted the sitemap on August 24th, and another one earlier on August 12th, but it's still saying couldn't fetch. One more thing. When you try to inspect any URL based on your website, Under page indexing, the error says that it's blocked by your robots.txt file. Here you can see the page crawling is blocked by robots.txt file, and same for page fetch. Now first let me tell you what's robots.txt file is. Robots.txt is a text file that webmasters create to instruct web robots, typically by search engine robots, how to crawl pages on their website. Now to check your robots file, open a new tab and type in your website's URL slash robots.dxt and hit enter here it says disallow all which means my indexing is blocked somehow but don't worry we're gonna fix it in this video so let's get right into it now by default this robots.dxt file is automatically generated by WordPress and if you're using Yoast SEO plugin this is the file which is generated, but in our case it says disallow, so let's fix it. Copy the second code, and log in to your WordPress dashboard. Under Yoast SEO menu, click on Tools. Now here, you must see an option named, File Editor. If it's not visible, don't worry, it's blocked by your malware removal plugin or, iTheme security. To fix it, go to your installed plugin section. Now locate your malware removal plugin. In my case it's iTheme Security. Deactivate the plugin temporarily. Now go back to Tools section. And now it should appear. Here you can see, option is now visible. Click File Editor. Here you can see the same disallow code which we saw earlier. Now replace the text which we copied earlier. This file will also be in description below. Now just save changes. Now if you go back to Search Console and try applying for re-indexing, it won't happen because the changes we made to robots.dxd file is not yet crawled by Googlebot. Once the Googlebot crawl the updated robots.dxd file, then we will be able to submit our sitemap and apply for re-indexing. It probably takes Google 24 hours to crawl the robots file. So let's wait for it. So it's been more than 24 hours and the sitemap is already showing successful. For your sake, I am gonna submit it again. Here you can see, no errors at all. And if we try to apply for re-indexing, No errors at all. So now it's all fixed. And our robots.dxd file is also updated. If this video helped you in any way, like this video and subscribe to my channel. See you later, alligator.